Hello Aries and welcome back to my channel, Lumen Moon Tarot. Aries, I am here looking into your month of June, the energy that you're going to be in or the energy that you're going to, you know, that's going to be around you in that month, okay? Um, this reading is for the collective, so it may not be for all of you, okay? Um, and just take what resonates, Aries, leave the rest behind, don't try to force anything. And thank you so much everyone for all of your support. Honestly, the likes, all of my subscribers, a huge thank you, thank you to all of you. Everybody new here, hi, I'm Becca. All right, so um, Divine, what do you have for Aries? Messages for Aries in June. Oh boy, somebody does not want to let you go. Holy tamole, they don't... You know, um, they could be married to somebody else, or this person sees you as the one. Um, I feel like that. I feel like, honestly, I feel like they don't want to let go of anybody. They don't want to let go of you and somebody else. Okay, um, they're being very manipulative here. I feel like they know that you could provide them with a very comfortable life. They could be finding out that you just got like a lot of money here, um, a big lump of money, or maybe this can be an opportunity as well. Um, they, they definitely see having a happy life here with you. Yeah, but this is a third party. Yep, uh, they've been keeping you waiting for a long time. They haven't been wanting to let go of you or a wife, okay? I feel like this person's already committed to somebody else. Um, but they're going to have to be honest here uh, what it is that they want. And they want a new beginning here with this Empress and the Minor Arcana. I feel like that's you, Aries. But you put yourself wherever you have to. There's three separate people here. Um, I've got a masculine and two feminine energies, one that they're already committed to. Yep, third party. They're making a decision. They're getting ready to speak their truth. And I feel like um, they're, they want to choose you here. This person's really stressed out, um, especially because they know they're going to have to go through a divorce. This could be like a big fight in divorce or this divorce could literally ruin them. Yep, that's the truth. It could ruin them. Okay. Um... What's this one here? Yeah, it's like they've been trying to avoid this here. They're also, they know that there's going to be a big fight. This is like a court battle, all right, for pretty much everything that they've got. They could be wanting to hang on to every bit of money they have left here. They could have been providing for a Queen of Pentacles um, that may be fairly materialistic. Here you are, okay, you're the one that they want, though. Okay, Queen of Wands, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius energy. Yeah, they know. Here's the thing. They're going to lose pretty much everything, Leo. Or um, Aries, sorry. They're going to lose pretty much everything, Aries, in a divorce, okay? Everything that they've worked for, all of their savings. This could be like a home, property, business even. All they're going to have left is this one pentacle here sitting in the dirt. All of their hard work that I feel like they know they stand to lose everything. If this person's trying to hang on to their money, this is going to cost them 90% um, of what they've got. They'll, be, they'll have nothing left if they divorce this Queen of Pentacles. Okay? It's going to be a huge fight. But the Divine is like, well, it's going to come down to the ground. Ha! <laughs> Yeah, because here's the thing. They've got one foot in, one foot out, right? One foot is thinking about you, and the other foot is married to this karmic. They're like right in the middle of a third-party situation that they're, it's like it's, it's unable to end because they're keeping it like a continuation. It's like on a loop. They may be making you wait for this person. Like, where's the clarity? Where's the answers? Um, where's the closure? You know, meanwhile, you're over here waiting for this person? Not anymore. You're not in the energy where you're waiting anymore. You're taking your power back. 
you're pulling your energy away from this person and you're looking forward into your future okay enthusiastic about your future but this person I feel like they put you in a third party they made you feel like an option okay and they know that they want you that's the thing they know they want this new beginning here with you that same pentacle laying in the dirt that stands for a new beginning and they know with you they could be happy and have emotional fulfillment but they don't want to get a divorce from this queen of of pentacles because they're going to lose like i said a property a business all of their stability all of their savings I mean, this Queen of Pentacles, they already know is going to clean them out. That's already telling me that's not love there. <clears throat> and I feel like this person knows it. And the Divine is like, look, we're bringing down the tower anyway. Either you tell the truth to this Queen of Pentacles and um, take the hit, right? Or we're, we're going to bring this down anyway. Okay. They're, they're either way they're going to lose out here this person's in a lot of regret now they're in a lot of regret now because they're going to have to give a lot to this queen of pentacles okay and um and if they don't they if they don't divorce this queen of pentacles um they're going to miss out on a blessing in love with you I feel like this person is just kind of like on shutdown mode wherever they are they're, they're I feel like they're really kind of ticked off about this okay they're not happy about the decision that they have to make and what they're gonna it's either lose the money and their stability or lose real love here and a, and a promising future right they don't want either one of those things to happen all they can think about is that they're in love with you here. They know they've got to make a decision fast, too. Or the divine is bringing it down. If this is coming to an end regardless. And I feel like your person knows that, okay? Yeah, it's just, it's time to decide, right? That's what the divine is telling this person. It's time to decide. You've got two, two wands here in a decision what's it going to be it's time to take action right make your decision now we're down to one wand right because they can only there can only be one um they can't stand in the middle anymore okay between the two of you they can't have one foot in and one foot out anymore they need to decide what's it going to be which wand are you going to choose take some action here um, they could be keeping this all a secret, or I feel like this could be your energy as well here, Aries. You know that this person is going through this. Okay? You can maybe feel their energy. King of Pentacles, that this is this married person. They're very concerned about materialistic things. They're worried about the property. They're worried about the, all the boy toys. They're worried about their savings and all that they've worked on this could be a business owner too that could lose half of their business or maybe even all of it depending on how hard this queen of pentacles worked for them like they're going to lose pretty much almost everything that they've got here and they know it and as a king of pentacles to take their stability away that is like the worst kind of suffering okay to this person all right what else can you show me here for aries and you're just over here by yourself you know not talking to anybody making plans for your future man this person really put you through it here they made you feel so awful in this connection this is all wants to come out in reverse but i'm not taking it all um, yeah, I feel like though this person's getting it. This is the only one that I'm taking in reverse. They all came out in a clump. They understand. They're about to lose the real soulmate connection here. And they're not going to have a complete victory no matter what they do. They're going to be losing something. That's what this is. No matter what they do, no matter what decision to make, they're going to be losing something big here. Either true love 
or everything that they've worked on um, or worked for with this Queen of Pentacles. Okay? And I feel like they know this. They know. Um, yeah, this is coming to an end. Yeah, they're about to they're about to lose this um, this ace of cups here is going to get taken away. The opportunity is going to be taken away for this person if they don't get on it and come forward. They could be asking other people's opinions. They may be asking for help with a plan. What do I do? How do I hang on to my money and come and get this love? What do I do? This could even be them asking like for legal advice. Um, I'm not seeing a whole lot of legal here, but it could be. They're very, very burdened by all of this. Okay? They are. They're, um, yeah, and they're feeling like an idiot. Yep, you're moving on. They don't have any time left. You're moving on in Empress Energy with, with the Wheel of Fortune turning in your favor. Okay? And they're sabotaging this love connection. This is that Two of Cups. This is that soulmate connection. So, you know what? Um, man, either way, this person's going to be sabotaged. Or not sabotaged. They're sabotaging something for themselves here. They're going to lose something. Um, I feel like they need to make some kind of sacrifice here. It, it's, it's either tr true love or their money and stability. They have to sacrifice something. Um, or something is going to be sacrificed. That's the feeling that I'm getting here. For you, though, however, Aries, I feel like you're moving on. Um, you've learned all your lessons. You passed all your tests. You did everything the divine has asked you to do, okay? You really went by the book. And it has elevated you into the Empress throne, okay? You've learned every queen in the deck here. Um, you're abundant. You're stable. You could have your own business um, that's growing into a success, okay? And the Wheel of Fortune is turning in your favor, so you've got lots of opportunities coming in. Lucky things, right? Um, a lot of abundance, right? This could be where you're going in the future. You could end up having a fortune in the future, but this person, it, it's almost like they continue to sabotage this connection. So I feel like um, the divine is bringing it down for them, I got to say. Uh, you could be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Aries, Virgo, I feel like this person could actually get sick off of this because I want to burp, but it feels like they're going to get sick, okay? It really does. It feels like they're kind of sick over this. All right, so, um, yeah, but they have to sacrifice something. It's either this blessing and love, this true love, or it's all of their um, stability that they've worked for, okay? Okay. Yeah, the divine is like, what are you going to do? We know what you're wishing for, but what are you going to do? See, it takes, it, 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 it takes their cup to come towards love, right? Are they going to offer you that cup for wish fulfillment? You know, giving to other people, right? No, are they going to, they can only choose one. They can't have both. And I think that's what they want. Yep, no, they, they're like, hey, can we, can we just talk? Can we just start off as friends? No, they're still giving to someone else, and you will be breadcrumb. They can't have both. So what's it going to be, right? What is it going to be? Are they going to offer this cup? See, they keep thinking, well, maybe I can come to the collective and make things up with them and at least be their friend and you know see what happens at nope no more keeping an empress stuck and no more um, being dishonest with other people okay I feel like they want it they don't want to let you go but they want to breadcrumb the empress no but but I can't stop thinking about everything no what are they gonna choose see uh-uh 
That's how the divine is handling it. Nope. What are you going to choose? They can't stop thinking about you. Um, but they can't give to both to both situations anymore. The divine's not going to have it. So what is this person going to do? Because you're moving forward. I feel like you're moving on. And this person's about to apologize here. But like I feel like you're going to say the same thing. You've got to cut someone else out first. You're like You won't let them get away with this either. Okay? It's unacceptable. You, you know if this person doesn't come to you single, that apology really, um, whatever offer this is, it's inadequate. Okay? And you're going to move forward unless they come to you correct and single. This person, they can't hold on to both people. They can't do it. And they're going to lose something. It's either going to be true love or it's going to be their their um, their foundation. Okay? Oof. Anyway, yeah. Um, Aries, that's what I have for this reading. I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates with you. Um, like and subscribe to the channel, right, if you like this vibe. And until next time, Aries, take care of you and peace out.